hello, hello, and welcome back. Garden Sims are really having their time right now. Everybody loves a garden sim at the moment. So I thought after we spent some time on Garden Life, a cozy simulator, we should check out Botany Manor as well. See if there's going to be as much chaos for me to start. As much panicking and anxiety in this garden as there was in that garden. I'm not sure, but we'll find out. And having said that, let's go. Eighteen ninety Botany Manor, Somerset. Ooh, hoo, hoo, she's sensitive. Okay. Oh, okay. Well, just okay. That's a bit better. Let's go. Where are we going? Oh, acceleration is high. It's fine. We can sprint around. Seems fine. Okay. Summit is sparkling. Collect parcel. Arabella Green, Botany Manor, Somerset. Is that me? Forgotten Flora, a herbarium. A herbarium by Arabella Green. Dear Arabella Green, thank you once again for submitting your book proposal, Forgotten Flora. Please send this empty herbarium back to us once you have completed your research and we'll be in touch with a potential offer. Sincerely, Mayflower Publishing House. Researched and compiled by Arabella Green, 1890. Chapter 1. Oh, maps. I have none. Okay. Oh, wow. I have, I have nothing. I have nothing. Nothing. Okay. I have something. Lady Arabella. We're so happy to have you back at Botany Manor. I hope you had a lovely trip. In your absence, I'm afraid some things in the manor have deteriorated, though I can assure you we tried our best to keep things in order. Did you? I hope it doesn't affect your research too much today, Bennett. I don't believe that you did try your best. I think if you did, it wouldn't be in disrepair. Can I go up there? I'd like to, uh... Nope. Okay. Oh, wow. A fresh start. Oh, shiny, shiny for me. Seeds, thanks. Okay. Windmill wart. I want to grow the windmill wart to filter the smoggy air in my conservatory. I'll need to research its temporary requirements first. Okay, it seems like I'm going to have a lot to do. I'm going to inspect this. Uh, yep, that that is a fine looking pot. Try again. Okay. Right, well, I don't know. I'm just gonna keep it. I guess it's mine now. Thanks. Oh. Uh, potting instructions: place a pot on saucer, add the soil, plant a seed, water the seed. One would think. That should be easy enough. Okay, well that's on a, a saucer. So, soil. I have a seed. Didn't she say I needed to research it though before I was allowed to do this? I think it's fine. I'm not going to inspect all of those. I'm just going to assume... Oh, so I do I need to, okay, right, I need to find out things. Somerset Falls, victim to industrial smog. I can barely see. Horse bus, a horse bus driver. Is that a bus being led by horses? Oh my goodness. Can we bring those back? I think we should, but the cities, we should just have everything. Horse and carts. We should absolutely do that. Um, Okay. Good. Brilliant. Postcard from Marianne. Mm. Dearest Arabella, on my hike I came across the windmill wart, a flower that only grows in Sicily. Some locals told me the flower has air purifying qualities, but due to its bespoke temperature requirements, the plant rarely blooms. Maybe the flower could help with the smog pollution in your conservatory. Your friend and peer, Marianne. Um... Right, so you're not going to tell me about its bespoke temperature requirements then, Marianne. 
Important clues get added to the herbarium where you can assign them to plants. If you're stuck, tracking clues can help you organise and validate your research. I haven't filled in all the right clues this, but I've already grown it, though. Oh, dear. The postcard is definitely for that plant. What is this? I don't know. All I don't know, though. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? Oh, dear me. Oh. For Mediterranean wildflowers. Um... If it's a volcanic flower, so from Sicily, 60 degrees then it wants to be at. Yeah? Yes. 60 degrees. Yes. Windmill wort, volcanic flower. Volcanic flowers from Sicily are at 60 degrees. So... Nice. I mean, that seems raging hot, but whatever. Uh, oh, oh, wait, hang on. I didn't actually click on that. Maybe I... Okay. Okay. Nice. So, now then. Temperature chart. Wildflowers. Yay! I did it. Good for me. Okay. Well, we've done all we can do. Uh, but I can't leave, it would seem. But I've done everything. Oh, oh wait. It's real hot in here, everyone. Oh god, let me out. There's a chance I might pass out. Can I, can I do some more? I need some more sources. Inspect it. Nice. Okay. Great. Am I meant to put it somewhere? Over there, maybe? Oh, I don't know. I really don't know. Well. I want to pick up... No, go away. So I can't. I have to just leave it over here, because apparently... I can't pick up a saucer. Unless there's any other sources just left around. That one. Okay. Put it over here, then. Seems fine. That oh, I was just on a whim. Fair enough. Look at it. Yay. Oh, it does windmill. That's delightful. I want to grow the windmill wort to filter the smoggy air in my conservatory. Oh no, we've done that. Yeah, we've done it in time. Anemone of February. Naturally grows in volcanic soil, which is why it requires a soil temperature of 60 degrees. The bud contains air purifying qualities, so the flower can filter its environment from dense smog. Excellent work, me. Hey! Can I leave? Yeah. We got stuff to do, things to plant. Go this way. Mm hmm. Drawing from nature. Can we open it? No. Okay. Glad we did that. Anything else? What are you? Can't look at you. Okay. Okay. Go. Go, go, go. This is massive. Do I own all of this? Can I go up that ladder? No. A peephole. Ooh. Oh my goodness. If it's just me doing the gardening, there's just there's a lot, a lot to do. Should hire some help. I have a key. Okay. Okay. I'm currently busy researching. Please leave all deliveries in the gatehouse and ring the bell, Arabella. Okay. Okay, so that just stays there then, I guess. How do I get things? Oh, wait, no, I... I... Some people ring that for me. 
Botany Manor, home of the Green family. Can I go this way? No, so presumably that key is for over here. I really like the cartoony graphics. It makes my brain happy. Sit down. Oh, lovely. Look how massive my house and garden is. I know it's called a manor, but it seems a little bit bigger than a manor. It's more like a castle. Sit down again. Oh yeah, the view from this one's very nice as well. Let's go. I'm not going to sit down on those ones unless I get an achievement for it. Okay. Shake a locked door. I want to do some more planting. Let me do planting. Can I have the secateurs? Secateurs? Nope. Oh, that was fast. See, sometimes I think that it's too slow. Can you hear that? What is that? A duck! Inspect a duck. Nice. That's a good duck. <laughs> wait though i don't know because if i plant more that just doesn't make sense because it needs to be 60 degrees that's a trick a trick that is my dearest arabella i hope this letter finds you well as you set off for london on your important trip the thought of you in the bustling city working on your ambitions both excites and worries me Time has indeed passed, and yet your determination for your field remains inspiring to me. I never imagined all those years ago that we would be writing to each other in our fifth decade about such endeavours. I look forward to hearing about your progress, and of course let me know how I can be of assistance upon your return. Your loving sister, Elizabeth. Okay. Thanks, Elizabeth. You could help me do some gardening, quite honestly. There's a lot to do. There's a heck of a lot to do. And I don't see you anywhere, Elizabeth. Lizzie. Come on, Lizzie. Give us a hand. This way? It's another cuckoo. Um, This really reminds me of a... Uh, a place near me called the Forbidden Corner where it's all maze-like and big gardens and it's great it's a great time um what am I doing Is that my walking stick <laughs> my dear friend good luck on your trip I would have loved to join you like in our younger days, but your tales about the trip will suffice when we next meet. I will never forget the Maria Jackson passage you once highlighted to me. In examining plates, you take the authority of others. Whereas in botany, as in all other things, we can make little progress if we do not see for ourselves. Well, now you must travel and see some interesting specimens for yourself. I am inspired and look forward to hearing all about it. Your friend always, Eleanor. Oh my goodness, that cookie really needs to stop. Wait, is she still with us? I hope she is. Don't need to be dealing with any tragedy. Okay. Wait, uh, yeah, this is back. There was more locked doors, wasn't there? So there should be more keys. This is a puzzle game, isn't it? I And I'm not puzzling. I'm not even remotely puzzling. Is there any more sources? Damn it. Yeah, we've read everything. This, this goddamn cookie needs to stop. 
So. There was somewhere I needed another key for, right? Excuse me. Me. Is it just me that lives here? Madness. Uh, where was it that needed a key? There. Oh, it's locked from the other side. I don't need a key. So, then. How do I get to the other side? Green, Ursula, uh, okay. Family tree. Lady Arabella Green, I'm pleased to let you know that your family tree is complete, carefully tracing the history of your lineage. As per your request, I have altered the customary presentation now displaying the maiden names of the ladies in your family rather than their current names acquired through marriage. Okay, good, yeah, fair enough. Should you require any further adjustments or have additional inquiries, I remain at your service. Yours, Robert Hinchley, genealogist. Nice. So we've all got our maiden names. Great. I like it. I like, I like what you're doing there. We don't need to sit down. That's fine. Um, is that just a tree inside of the house? That's fair enough. This lady obviously lives for this kind of stuff. Taunton to London Paddington. Issued for return journey. I don't know where Taunton is. Elderly discount applied. I suppose they did, she did say she was in her fifth decade. I wouldn't have classed that as elderly, though. Come on. Um, okay, okay. Let's go this way. This seems like a good way. Let's these. Fulguria. Ulex Fulguris. I came across the Fulguria when I was caught in a terrible thunderstorm. I'm interested to learn more about its growth requirements. Okay. It's just it's so strange to me. That this lady is in her fifth decade of doing botany and yet she knows nothing. We need to find out all of the things again for her to grow plants. A blurry photograph, yep. Camera experiment one. I purchased a new camera and flash lamp to document my flowers. The picture looks a little blurry though. I'll have to investigate the camera settings. It's mad considering 1890 in the UK. It's like this. And yet America was still... Cowboys. Still Red Dead Redemption. The picture is so dark, impossible to see the flowers. I can't believe how quickly I've run out of that incredibly expensive flash powder. Oh, I'm very pleased with this picture. It looks like I'm getting the hang of the camera. Nice. Good job. Good job, Arabella. So I guess we should do all of the downstairs before we go upstairs. That would make sense, wouldn't it? Hmm, inspect the flask. What is this for? Do we have to do science? Put it, just put it back. Put it back. Oh my goodness. <gasps> we do have to do science. Amazing. Can I do science now? Will these things run out? If I add random stuff. If I add some magnesium. And uh, let's do some sodium. And uh, uh, some uh, sulfur. And uh, uh, some... That's it. Put it back. Well, I'm just going to leave that there for now. It, it's fine. The art of painting. Okay. Sit down. Just have, a, have a little sit. Have a cup of tea and a sit down. Oh my goodness, there is a cup. There's a cup of tea. Nice. Is that a biscuit? What is that? A cup of tea and a biscuit? in our chemical lab that I've probably just create, created some sort of horribly poisonous gas. It's fine. Let's go. Wow. This house is massive. In this day and age, if this is real or based on a real place, uh, it would be a museum now. Some ancient Celtic tribes practiced a coming-of-age ritual. This meant that when someone was considered old enough, 
it was time to prove themselves worthy of staying in the tribe. One of these rituals involved picking flowers in the woods, though not just any flower, of course. The gatherer had to find a fulguria. For this flower is known to only bloom during thunderstorms, keeping a cool head while lightning flashes were while lightning flashes were striking left and right of you. Yeah. Keeping a cool head while lightning flashes were striking left and right of you was considered the ultimate test of courage. So is that a clue? Yes. Okay. Good. Good, 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 good. Who's lit all these fires? Not this elderly lady. Arabella and Elizabeth. Does not say the year. Yay, I have a key. I don't know. Oh, for the back terrace it says it says what it's for. A key? Is the key a clue? No. Okie dokie. Lady Arabella, these past weeks I've been seeing lots of bright flashes coming from the back room of your house. It scares my cows immensely as they think a storm must be coming. My oh, do we need to do the science to make a lightning flash and then the flower will be tricked and it will grow? My milk production is taking a hit because of this, and if you enjoy your fresh milk in your morning cup of tea, I do. I would advise you to keep the flashes to a minimum. Farmer Charles. Couldn't just say Charles, he had to specify. Watson's flashback. Oh no, wait. No, it was the photography, maybe? I don't know. Ooh, we can make some. Potassium and magnesium, a two to one ratio. We can do that. And make some flash powder. There's nothing to take a picture of. I'm not doing it. I'm not taking a picture of nothing. I'm not wasting more of her flash powder. That's ridiculous. So we're going to have to put a plant there. Maybe if we plant the plant and then we flash at it, then it will grow. I understand. I don't need any more clues. I, I get it. I understand. I need to make flash powder. Uh, should we do one flower at a time or do I go for all of the clues first the Dartmoor line um, kitchen can I enter no so this I've only got the key for the back terrace so maybe we should do the floor Pyrophiles, fire has the potential to be among the most devastating forces of nature. Despite this, humans have developed the ability to invent, wield, and attempt to manage it. Meanwhile, certain species in the plant kingdom have evolved to adapt and flourish in the face of fire. In areas where forest fires occur frequently, pyrophiles have learned to rely on fire as a crucial part of their life cycle. Facts about pyrophiles, their seeds typically possess tough shells. Some pyrophiles only bloom when surrounded... Oh, I thought a person was a pyrophile. Ooh, when surrounded by smoke aromas from the natural habitat. Okay. No, that doesn't... Oh, it's not this one, though, is it? It's not this one. This will be the next one. It'll be whatever that is. Maybe. My... No. no. Is this a quicker way... Oh, no, this is where it was locked before. Wait, no, I can do it down there. It's fine. Meow. Um, let's do soil. Nice. <gasps> it's blue! Okay, okay. Uh, this way? You go there. I'm gonna. It's two to one, right? Potassium and phosphorus. Yeah, two potassium, one magnesium, not phosphorus. Okay. Uh, you into there. That was a mistake. Two potassium. Two potassium. One magnesium. And. 
Okay. Do I just put this in the thing? What do I do with it? <gasps> uh, just you go there for a hot second. I don't know what I do with that. Do I just leave that there, maybe? And... Why is it not flashing? What have I done wrong? No, I thought I was so smart. Cleverest of all the people. Yay! The fulgoria only grows during thunderstorms while the flashes of lightning provide the bright light the flower needs to bloom because of its dangerous growing conditions. Not many people have witnessed its beauty. I don't even have, I don't even need all the clues. Oh. None of these I think are for. That one? Yeah? I don't know. This might be a tough case to crack. The ash plume. But we are going to work on the ash plume next time. I hope you enjoyed the introduction to Botany Manor. And if you are having a good time, please like and sub and leave a comment about anything else you'd like to see on this channel. And until next time, I think that's it.